I don't know where you are, but just come home or call or something. So the interesting thing about the Penny Boudreaux video is that she shows a classic sign of emotional deception. She is attempting to appear distressed because her daughter is missing, but she's not showing an engagement of the distressed muscles, which are the corrugators, in between the eyes, which generally when somebody is distressed, they go together and up. The deceptive pleaders generally are unable to engage those muscles and they end up looking more like a deer in the headlights. They look surprised. I took her for a drive that day just to try to have a heart to heart with her in a place like in a car she can't get away and slam her door, which she usually does to me. In this frame and a couple of frames uh, after it, Penny dis displays hostility both in her facial expression and in the words she uses and her tone of voice, indicating that she's still very upset, angry with Carissa for one reason or another. She doesn't want the world to know that she's feeling that, but it's coming out uh, involuntarily. Can I ask you what this has been like as a mother? Penny responds to the question from the interviewer with a flash of anger and hostility. She knows that her daughter is dead. The interviewer is asking questions that are getting a little too close to home. 